in this part of video i want to tell you to see the front effect in transmission line what is a front effect front effect front effect is the raise of receiving end voltage as compared to sending end voltage mean when receiving end voltage are greater than sending end voltage in part 1 of my video we draw a this diagram in this part we see the we see the result for only resistive pure resistive load after that in this video we see the behavior of inductive load and capacitive load so we go to diagram in which we made in part 1 of this video so only we put the value of inductor so we see that its value is 5 power 6 or 3 okay after that go to power guy go to tool and go to steady state so you see here the voltage measurement voltage measurement one current measurement current measurement one is this this is the angle between voltage and current so after that we put a capacitive load we say that it is a 10 e power 6 so apply okay no when we add the capacitor value so you see capacitor here in this diagram so to see run analysis go to power guy tools and steady state so you see here this is the value of voltage and current source so after this experiment we see inductive load capacitive load and we change the shunt reactor value okay no we change the shunt reactor value so first for in first case we put 3 10 ki power minus 3 so no put 10 ki power minus 6 see the behavior of reactor okay go to power guy go to tool go to steady state to see the behavior now you see the behavior receiving and voltage are very 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 low 0.130 and receiving and current is greater than no we change the reactor value we say turn the power we say the value of reactor is 1 hundred okay so no no see the behavior of this sending and voltage receiving and voltage sending end current and receiving end current no the reactor value is greater than you see the effect here voltage and current receiving and voltage and receiving and current so in this experiment we see all behavior of inductive below optimum value optimum value and check the above optimum value so at the end of this video please like and subscribe my channel for more video okay thank you